Oh my word. All the kale. Oh, we're gonna fall. One second. There's a farm with like fish. Can you go out and pick that? So yeah, I'm just gonna go for a little walkie tee. Um, and Jason will come on his phone, some firework. All our mo everybody's plans are out for this month. So I can just kind of chill if he's um, needing to do that. And I just wanna consume. I don't know if you guys have ever had that. And where it's like just getting all the music, all the podcasts, all the books, let's go work out. That's probably the only exponential. Let's like chat and connect with people. That's exponential. And then everything else is like, give me you. <laughs> well, mental health, guys, or emotional health, physical health. It's all super important shit. Spiritual health, whatever it is. Um, yeah, so I'll see you guys later, hopefully. Most likely. Alrighty, so we are back from the farmer's market. I didn't want to film there because I just wanted to leave people alone. But look at all of this glorious veg. Isn't this crazy? Oh my word. All the kale. Oh, we're going to fall. One second. Um, so we got a bunch of chard. We got some kale. Got two heads of cabbage. We got some broccoli, bam, and then we got a thing of figs. I already started eating one because they're amazing. And then we got these two massive heads of lettuce. Like, aren't these huge? They could take up literally the entire bag. We got a head of this nice green stuff. I guess I'll just dump it. some food and um we will just go from there all right bye all right so this is kind of how we like to do things and just cook it up in this pan and i got my potatoes and my toast and my lovely fresh farm eggs and some ham and this is just some squash that we're kind of frying up got some chopped onions so we're gonna just dip that in there make a little eggy sandwich type thing it's gonna be awesome oh i love living here it's so amazing all right bye all right so we are off on a totally spontaneous outing mom figured out how to pay bills on her computer i helped a little bit Yay! She did most of it. Yay! And we're going off to this beach spot that I found this morning. And yeah, I'll film when I get there. And I'm really excited because it's so beautiful. I can't wait to show you. It's so beautiful. And it's just this little pocket of paradise that was like right at the end of our street. And we had no idea. Where we live is just like every, like everywhere. It's just like little pockets of paradise. It's gorgeous, and I'm so not used to it. And it's wonderful. Yay! Okay, love you. See you soon. Bye. Oh, just kidding. just kind of huh, 
Like I told my mom this morning, I was just like wandering around in awe. This is so beautiful, and I just had no idea this was out here. Isn't this nuts? All these trails, and it's just such a nice day. It's a little bit breezy, not too chilly. I just ate all the blood is like in my stomach, so that's kind of why I'm bundled up. But it's, I don't know how, it's like what? 16 degrees today? That's Celsius. So yeah. I gotta like this again. Mmm. It was so beautiful. Um, my mom likes to roll these sort of herb cigarettes that are, what is this one? This one is just some, um, and all of it is, you know, 100% organic because I, oh my word, look at these gorgeous trees. Oh, and I have to show you guys this Arbutus that we passed by. It looks just like a, this dancing tree spirit. Um, I, we, I like to smoke. It's like a blend of uh, mullein, tobacco, and cold split. And I find on days when I'm a bit sleep deprived, the tobacco is really perfect for like grounding and giving me that little extra bit of energy. Say hi, Mama Bear. Hi there, we Bear. made it. Yeah, we sure did. We just walked all the way down along this ridge all along the beach side there and then came up through these trails here. Oh, and we're just hanging out, just walking around in awe like I was this morning. Wow. Mm. An avenue of our beauty. I know. How good is that? Uh, uh. Nope. This is so nice. rented uh, kayaks the other day and we went out here it was so nice that was so funny we saw a map of like we went pretty far out but you wanted to go um, like out and around to but uh, butcher gardens right that's where you were aiming mom I didn't realize it was butcher gardens I was just aiming for that little cove oh whoa look at that Um, yeah, I don't, I don't 
can't remember. More muscles! Arr. You're so beautiful. Hi. <laughs> okay, guys. So like I said, uh, this is just a basic home workout. Um, here I'm just doing some Bulgarian split squats. I really like to lean forward. I find that helps really engage the glutes quite a bit more. Um, just a nice deep full range of motion here and this next one um, overhead lunges I really enjoy the carryover these have to uh, like more athletic things like biking and hiking I don't do a lot of direct quad work I find I get all the benefits I have from that I need really from like front squats and just different kind of lunge and lunging variations um, and then this uh, Single leg Romanian deadlifts. Um, I don't do these with a ton of weight. I could do more, but I really just like focusing on um, the like the squeeze, but more of the stabilize, like strengthening the stabilizers in your hips. Um, so, if you're a dancer or a gymnast or you Olympic weightlifter, you can be you can get really tight hip flexors, and we want strong hip flexors, not tight hip flexors. And there's a lot of benefits to just going really slow in order to strengthen all those little stabilizers, as well as the nice pump in the glutes. Um, then here, this is just a regular dumbbell shoulder press. I want you guys to notice how I'm pressing up and slightly back. That's going to be the most beneficial for not only getting the front head of the deltoid, but the medial head. Um, and then again, working the medial head again. Just a little regular lateral raise, doing my best here to relax my neck and think about uh, pushing with my shoulder. You don't want to lift the dumbbell, you really want to think about pushing it. Um, a little note I wanted to actually add on to the airplane, uh, or sorry, the single leg RDL, was um, you really want to think about uh, pushing the floor away from you um, and squeezing the hamstring as you come up. Uh, this is just a regular dumbbell bicep curl again relaxing my neck thinking about putting my brain in the bicep and almost contracting that muscle before I start to lift the dumbbell I find that's gonna give you a lot more benefits in regards to isolating that uh, that muscle head as you you know squeeze up instead of using momentum or trying to lift it um, and then this last one is a handstand drill this one, I think is the same one that I showed you in the other video. So again, I really love it for stretching out the medial line. Um, your transverse abdominis, of course, has to do a ton of work here to keep your lumbar safe. And then you're gonna get a great stretch on that inner thigh and your obliques are gonna be working like cray cray to uh, keep you safe with all this, uh, with a lot of like anti with their anti-rotation capabilities. Um, yeah, I did a little core workout that morning, but that was pretty much it. It was nice. Just a little glute and delt pump work, basically. And that's all. Thanks. Bye.